Hello guys, welcome back to GTA 5 again. So let us see what is going on over here. Uh, who is Dawn? Alright, let us get to this area to find Dawn. Hopefully, we all will know what, what's going to happen over there. Okay, let us see. Is there a car? Should be this. Car, yes. Alright, let's move on to the next mission. Who's Dawn? Huh? So, Michael... Uh, no, no, no. Franklin have a new mission, I guess. A new set of missions. See, guys, the the GTA story mode itself, you can as you can see that it seems like have never ending uh, story inside this this map. It it has a long story mode, which makes you feel like catching it up. That you feel like interacting in the more of the story. Want to understand more what's going to happen to them? Yep. Uh, so this is the good thing about how are you go going to go do good contents about of the out, of man. the game because um, usually gamers itself is looking for good story mode yep if there is good story mode they will keep on playing as a uh, for the game for the game yep to understand better that uh will will want to follow up on the, on the story that what is going on on the characters hopefully that oh sorry Man, fuck this shit. Yep. so this is the thing that i i usually admire a lot on how how developers is design designing on the game itself that create uh, gamers to be interested and give ratings of how how good is the gameplay mm -hmm. usually like uh, developers and writers of the games have put in good story mode on usually will give good remarks and hope then there will be the part 2 series more and more parts yep hey there he is mr conservative man what the fuck are we doing here Nothing. oh okay, it is the parachute something that's gonna help me get some tail from those midwestern ladies that i get to meet online Let's pretend for a second that you're not so much of a pussy and vamos, as my cleaning lady would say. Uh, just to be clear, uh, I'm not racist. I, I meant that ironically. I, uh, I have a black friend, and uh, I didn't even really notice that you were black, uh, or whatever your people call hey, it. Get the fuck out of here. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so ATVs. Let's roll! Let's roll where? Catch you on the flip side, buddy. Yo, you see that? Airports on the Dominator's payroll today. Better bond fast with that beauty, cause you two are going tandem. I didn't bring my idiot translator. What the fuck are you talking about? You're driving that hunk of metal and gasoline out of a cargo plane. I'm doing fucking what? We're spirit brothers, homie. Two sides, one coin. You can't bail on me now. Okay. Person I touch? Uh, yeah, okay, air <laughs> five then. Parachute? Check. ATV? Check. Big pair of balls? Uh, uh, check. Okay, this is happening. Oh, God. Come on, let's fucking do this. Seems like it. This is so on, awesome. Let's no, no, oh, no. Let's do God. Shit was way too intense. Ha ha! Pants floor at the back to the front, eh? Well, check me out. Angry Hawk into side slide. Rotisserie dumping for a slide. Masterfully executed by the Dominator. Oh, come on. That's female, dude. Boobies. Yo, 
you, I can see you being a real hit with the ladies, homie. Dude, you have no idea. You should see me online. Like flies on a turd, bro. Man, you said it, not me. What? Never mind, let's try again. Let's land nicely. Slow and steady. Yep. He's going down. It should be going down. Okay, good. God. Damn it. You feel that? Lightning bolt! Zap! You're alive! You know how it feels! <laughs> Man, I know how it feels to ride an ATV out of a damn airplane! Man, how much that shit cost you per second? <laughs> it's relative, bro! How long did it take me to earn the bills? Listen, you go out walking amongst the drones. I'll be on top of the maze bank building with the higher beings. Dominator out! Oh, uh, one thing is, I just give you a what the fuck. <laughs> okay, never mind. Let us move on to Michael since we saw the Michael's main missions. We'll move on to Michael's mission. Hey, baby, you looking for a date? No thanks, gorgeous. I'm happily married now. <laughs> All right. So if let's say you want to get some action, you can. Hey, you having a midlife crisis? You made it. Good. I saved you again, Davy. Again. So what are you gonna do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living. Okay. We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve? He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. Are they going to get rid of travels? That's not going to happen, I guess. That's not going to happen. I would not betray my friends, you know? That's wrong. Never mind, we shall go back to the mission. Let's go head down to Michael's house and see what's going on. Right. Yeah. So. You got lucky, buddy! The FIB is corrupt wants Michael, Frank and Franklin to get rid of travels. That is not going to happen. That's wrong. Do you think that you're going to betray your friends, guys? No, that's not my style. Okay. Are you going to Oh I know. You're, you you're, you're buying we'll a nice clothes. 
Yep, tuxedo. Everything is done. We are watching a movie. Oh, handsome, huh? The producer does not drive himself to the premiere. Come on! Oh, you're here. Wow! The Oriental Theater. On we are in the limousine. Open that champagne, Jimbo. Woohoo! Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where are you going with that? Oh, Woo, my dad's a movie producer! Jimmy, get back down here. Which makes me a movie producer's kid. <laughs> Jimmy! Oh my I'm going to ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work. And I'm going to get a sports car and a drug habit before appearing on Reality Rehab Show. And then I'm going to sell my story and become really judgmental. And I'm going to use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer too. And I'm going to make even shittier movies than my dad does. Because I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. Woo! Yeah! You see the street's edge losers? Jizzle in the movie bizzle. Hear that, Vinewood? You hear that, Vinewood? Hey, I hear it, and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental <laughs> Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Get back down here. Behave, to, can like, you? Gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited. V to the I to the P. Jimmy. Read my necros. Entitled. E-N-T. Uh, titled. Cause I am Jimmy! Oh, Pop, chill. I'm done spraying this shizzle. Let's take a drink. <laughs> Jimmy, shut up a second. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Sure, yeah, hey. You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget. Look, Devin, I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely, Slick. Forgive and forget. Namaste. Check it out. It's a premiere. Wow. This is awesome. It's good. There's a red carpet. Pop, you know, oh I'm God. really proud of you, even though you did make a pretty shitty movie. Well, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride go. by showing up to the lake. Uh, of course. Hi. Not. And uh, have you ever uh, thought maybe I shouldn't shoot sex scenes in a green screen kind of environment? Yeah, yeah. Hi, girls. Uh, are you the movie stars? Thanks, Antonio. Give me nice and tight. Hey, it's Laszlo on the red carpet of Meltdown. Some big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're gonna see some side boot tonight. Come on. We did it! Solomon! We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I'll see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards, Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Uh, I'm Laszlo from uh, Fame or Shame, um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh... Oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Really modern stuff. <laughs> Pervert. Come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over She's here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um, love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a hug. Okay. That really affected me. All right, I gotta go. Thank you so much. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hey, hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what a movie, huh? Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. 
Such a pleasure working with you. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife, seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> you twisted what? Fuck. You're a dead man. Let's go, Jim. Come on. God damn it. Hold on. Where's mom and Tracy? The girls are in danger. We gotta get to the house. Yep, we need to save the house. The the ladies now. God damn it. What happened? I don't know. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I gotta say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. All right. Okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He, he's not a gangster or anything. No. He's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. He says he's got all these connections. I'm sure it's just talk. That's not a family car. Oh my all god. Alright, Jimmy, you keep yourself concealed. I'll go get the girls. You gotta save Daddy's home! Bricks! Ah, one of them's in the Don't tree. touch my wife. Woohoo! Good shot! Okay. Just stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, man. Don't you worry about me. Clear All right. the building! No one leave! You sure? Fire in the hole! Fuck. Not yet! Stay put! Don't give him the opportunity! Finish him off! Get him! We got a man down! I need you to cover me up! No one touched my family! Bidding. Oh fuck. No one touched my wife. My family. Don't come near us. Where are you? Don't hide. Right. This is what you're going to get if you touch my family. You know? Trace, Amanda, I think they're gone. Oh, guys, okay. God damn it. Got you, dick. Uh, it'll be all right. <laughs> no, it's not. What was that? Oh. Someone there? I'm going to start shooting. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off. <laughs> oh. Oh. Get Ooh. the fuck off me. <sighs> I, I thought I was on that guy. Oh. So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging. I really fucked him up good, though, huh? <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. <laughs> Oh my god, Jimmy. <laughs> Alright. It's a nice game. A nice episode. He saved his family. They 
came to my house, Lester. My house! So I asked Amanda and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Meriwether isn't sure on excuses to come and kill you, nor is Devin Weston. I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. All right, right. I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Depository? Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. That's smart. Meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor. Alright guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys on the next episode. This is a fun episode. Then.